This is the story of a woman who went for a very, very long walk. Her name was Sue Kenny, and she walked the Camino de Santiago de Compostela, a medieval pilgrimage route in Spain, on a spiritual quest to discover her life purpose. Her journey began by crossing the Pyrenees Mountains alone in the winter. She walked for 29 days, guided only by yellow arrows. As she walked, she noticed piles of stones placed neatly along the edge of the path. She assumed that they were placed there by the millions of pilgrims who had come this way before her. One evening, Sue was having dinner with a group of other pilgrims from all over the world. During a lull in the conversation, she asked if anyone knew why there were piles of stones along the way. Andreas, a troubadour of the Camino, spoke up to say that he knew a story about the stones. It is said, if you pick up a stone and put some of your sorrow into it, when you place the stone down, you leave your sorrow behind. The next day, the first thing Sue did was pick up a stone. She wasn't sure what to do, so she just imagined that she could put her sorrow into it. She carried the stone, rubbing it gently, and then placed it back down on the path. As soon as she did, something happened. There was a shift. An exhilarating, rushing sensation, like all the sorrow she had been carrying in her heart had vanished. It felt so good that she wanted to pick up another stone right away. Seeing a small round stone, she picked it up for her oldest daughter, Tara, and imagined putting her sorrow into it. The next stone was for her middle daughter, Megan. And finally, she picked up a stone for her youngest daughter, Simone. Now that she realized she could put the sorrow of others in the stones as well, she made a ritual of picking up stones every day. Fortunately, on the Camino, there was an endless supply. Several weeks later, she again met Andreas. She thanked him and explained the profound impact his story had on her journey. Then he told her that he didn't actually believe in sorrow stones. She was shocked. What do you mean you don't believe in them? She cried. I have just put all of my sorrow and the sorrow of everyone I know on the Camino. Are you telling me that it's not true? No, he replied calmly. What I am saying is that a friend told it to me and I was sharing it with you. It's just a story. It's just a story. It's just a story. It's just a story. It's just a story.